The way we are farming, the way we're doing agriculture, the way these multinational corporations are taking over, it's not serving the resiliency we need in our food systems. And it's not serving anyone in those food systems. Everyone is losing in this system. From the contract farmers, to the people that live around them, to the animals, to the food workers, future generations, everyone is losing but these multinational corporations that are growing bigger and stronger and have more influence than they have ever had before. Our health is at stake here. To raise animals in this way puts all of us at risk. This is everyday violence that's going on in our country that most people are just not aware of. You have these massive warehouses where pigs are packed in on top of each other. You know, pigs produce eight, nine times the feces that human beings produce. And the feces flows through it into these big lagoons. And so you see this, these huge lagoons of feces that are then pumped up into hoses and sprayed onto fields. The mist of feces float off of those spray fields and into communities. It's one of the reasons why a lot of this stuff flows into our rivers and streams. It's one of the reasons why one of the biggest dead zones on the planet is off the Gulf Coast, where the Mississippi River, with all of that refuse and feces and phosphates flowing into that river. And when people were telling me stories who live there about having the storms come, picking up all of that waste from those lagoons and just rushing it into rivers and streams and the overflow. It is just, the pictures alone are just disgusting. But to be there and listen to those stories while you're smelling that constant, unrelenting stench, it is like casting our fellow Americans to live in a constant hell. And these contract farmers, it'd be easy to vilify them, but many of them are in impossible situations because the big multinational corporation dictates to them everything that they have to do. This is such a perversion of our great heritage of, of farming and livestock. They are poisoning our soil, poisoning our groundwater, poisoning people, fellow Americans. They are stealing from them in the present and stealing from future generations. And so somehow we have got to let America know what's happening because we are a compassionate and a good people. But every single day, there are efforts going on to not let this truth be told. This is the worst, darkest corners of our history, and it's still going on right now. And it won't stop until we stop it.